Our mission today is to receive soldiers from Fort Sill, Oklahoma uh, and start the initial screening process for potential COVID-19 uh, prior to them starting AIT. We are doing a deliberate move uh, from soldiers from Fort Sill, Oklahoma to Fort Sam Houston due to the COVID virus that we're trying to keep from spreading across the, our forces. This morning, before they got on the bus to move from Fort Sill to here, they were screened by medical prof professionals to make sure that there was no coronavirus or any of that coming to our location. Keep your distance, six feet, keep your distance. Approximately 27 will be on the bus. They've been provided a, a meal. There's bathrooms on the bus so they can use the latrine there. Uh, so they don't have to get off the bus and make any stops. And so once they arrive here, they'll be ready to go and ready to execute our mission. Part of their onboarding as soon as they get here is to reiterate social distancing, ensuring that they're six feet apart, double arm interval, uh, and reiterate on why. It's the why behind it. The why is, is to reduce contact with each other that could potentially have the coronavirus. My leadership's been involved every step of the way, uh, from battalion to brigade, all the way up to the commanding general. Uh, we did our final brief yesterday with the commanding general at around 1600. We did a complete walkthrough. He got the warm and fuzzy of everything that we're going to do, uh, and so he could bless off and make any changes that he needed to make. We talk about hand washing continuously, and if there's no soap and water to use hand sanitizer. Um, our unit and our leadership has went out and, and provided extra hand sanitizer stations throughout the building. Um, there's one on every corner of our building you know, that we just hung up. We have signage everywhere throughout our AO uh, talking about the COVID-19 uh, information galore. Now, I'd also like to thank the soldiers that are out here. Um, we've beat into their whole body for the last 16 weeks, battle buddy team, battle buddy team, and then all of a sudden, social distancing. Um, it wasn't a very hard issue to break. Uh, they, we, we explained the why and explain why they had to do that and being combat medics they understood it and so i'd like to thank them for making my job easier by enforcing it and it's not just cadre enforcing it they enforce it amongst each other they'll, they'll continue to you know be social distant they understand the why behind it and what you know it brings to the formation and to the fight